Hey guys, Ricardo here. Welcome to another Blog Tech Tips. In today's tutorial, guys, I'll be showing you how to use Backtop to open an app. Now, in our last tutorial, I showed you the Backtop feature where whenever you go ahead and tap the back of your device. For example, I just triple tapped and you notice that I took a screenshot. And of course, with this new um, Backtop feature, you can have several commands. Now, one of the things people do not like is that they cannot launch apps. Or right away when they use the settings as I did in that last tutorial which I link below they find that they can't launch apps now of course there is a workaround to this and I'm gonna show you how to do that today you know to use the back top to open apps now of course to do this straight away guys you're gonna go ahead and let me just show you that it's not there or there's no app options so if you go ahead and go to settings and if let me just show you exactly how to get to the option when you go down to um, on the settings, accessibility, scroll down, look for touch. Then of course you tap on back tap. Let's use the double tap as an example. Notice here, there's all sort of stuff such as shake, Siri, spotlight, assistive touch, zoom, scroll up and so on. And of course there is no option here that says um, anything about apps. Notice here it says shortcuts. Down there it only says make QR code. Sajam, Sajam, text, last image, and what's this? What's a short, what's a shortcut, right? So let's just close and let's see what we can do right now. All right, so the first thing you do, guys, you're gonna search for the shortcuts option, which is this option right here. So go ahead and tap shortcuts. Once you're here, guys, you're gonna go ahead and um, hit the select or the plus. All right, guys, so once you're here, you're gonna hit add action. Then you're gonna search for open up and you should see some options here notice it says open up tap on open up and of course it says here choose go ahead and choose the app since we're just going to open it up and you're going to search for choose your apps for a particular app you can use search as well i'm going to choose instagram here seeing that instagram is a nice one to use i'm going to hit next once you're here it asks for a shortcut i'm going to give it the same name so i'm going to type in instagram All right, I'm going to hit done. There you go. Now the shortcut is added. Notice it says Instagram and it says one action. So if I go in here, notice it says um, open and that's open up and it says Instagram. We're done. And I'm going to close out. And of course, here, guys, I'm going to go back to settings. Once I'm in settings here, I'm going to scroll through. Once I scroll through right here, guys, uh, there should be an option around here. Um, as usual, so I'm going to go back to accessibility as before. We're going to go to the double tab option. So um, let's look search for accessibility. We're going to scroll down. Sorry, we're going to look for touch. We're going to look for back tap. And notice here before I had double tap for control center, I have triple tap for screenshot. So I'm going to go to double tap and here at um, control center, but I'm going to go all the way down. And on the shortcuts here, notice right now I have Instagram. This was not here before as I showed you. We're going to tap on Instagram. And now Instagram is set as the double tap option for opening. So I can um, go back or I could just simply close this out. And of course, if I go right now and I do the double tap. There you go, guys. Notice Instagram is now open. Forgive me, I do not have the internet, so let's try this again. Make sure I'm connected to the internet. All right, so we're connected to the internet, or we should be connected to the internet now. So I'm gonna double. All right, so we're connected to the internet. I'm gonna double tap my hands is around here. All right, there you go. So a quick double tap, and of course, um, Instagram has opened up. Notice right here, right now, it's working flawlessly. So let's do that one more time. There you go. So once I double tap easily, I'm taken to the Instagram app. So as you can see, it works fine. All right, guys. So in case you were curious how to use that double tap to open up a app, you now know to do that on your um, iPhone or iOS 14 device. All right. Three card saying bye until next time. Bye.